Hi, I would like to show you how to debug a Node.js application the easy way. Uh, here I've created a Node app, which is basically a, a simple server where uh, the first line essentially says that we need the HTTP module. Uh, here we create a server, which essentially takes a little function with a request and a response. And uh, first thing we do is write the status of 200, which is okay. And then we end uh, this particular session by uh, saying response.end is hello world. So that's all of our uh, app. And I'm using a free port of 8081. So this is uh, just a little server. Let's see if it is working. So we can say node app.js. Server should be uh, working. Uh, I can go into my Chrome and uh, go to the local port and I see the hello world response. So the server is all working and it's all good. So let me show you how to uh, debug this in uh, Chrome. So let's just kill this server right now. All you have to do is uh, install the node inspector. And to do uh, install the node inspector, you essentially have to be root uh, if you're going to be installing it on the Mac globally. And the command to do is uh, npm install minus g node inspector. Uh, I'm not going to do this right now because I've already installed node inspector. And once you have the node uh, inspector installed, there is a command called node debug that becomes available. So you can just run this node debug app.js. And as you see, it basically starts up the Chrome, uh, one of the Chrome tabs with the server running and everything. So basically, uh, let's just start the server. I have a breakpoint as well. And I'm going to start it. Uh, let's uh, send a request to the client and see what happens. And we come back in the server, as you can see, it is kind of waiting here. And uh, we can take a look at all of our global variables and local variables here. We can see the request. And uh, if we really let the debugger go on, it is going to write the response back and we can check that it is all working. As you can see, we got the response back and it's all good. So this is all there is to it and uh, good luck and happy debugging. Thanks.